Hi all, hope this finds you well and in good spirits. Well, it's certainly been a different type of time that we've been through recently, and it's so encouraging to hear how members are supporting one another, be it by email, letter, setting up phone trees, dropping off parcels and goodie bags on your daily walks, and of course, the now infamous Zoom meetings. Some of those will certainly go down in history. It's also been really heartwarming that when the call went out for scrubs, PPE, hearts, or whatever else our key workers needed, members were one of the first group there. Well done to everybody involved in that. We certainly are a resilient bunch, and it goes to show where there's a WI member, there's a Y. WI Centre may be closed at the moment, and our fab staff off on furlough, but that hasn't stopped the trustees and subcommittee members trying to keep you entertained, amused and educated, oh, that's a mouthful, with things on social media and the website. We have hope you've enjoyed those and the special editions of Essex WI News. They're going to carry on with that work and hoping to have a jam-packed year ready for next year when things go back to the new normal. On a personal level, I'm usually whizzing around the county at this time of the year with my advisor hat on. But this has certainly made me slow my pace of life down and actually I've quite enjoyed it. Reading books that I needed to, catching up on a few unfinished craft projects and a few binge watching on Netflix. On a personal level, I'm a really huggy person and I have missed hugging my friends and family. I'm hoping that as those restrictions lift, I can really give them a massive, massive hug. But I have pledged to spend more time catching up with people chatting on the phone or emails or seeing them in person as I think that's the thing we've all really missed. I hope to include many of you in that and look forward to seeing you all when restrictions lift. In the meantime, stay safe, take care. Can I have a drink now?